Praise God, everybody. I'm uh I'm gonna read uh I'm gonna start reading at uh first John chapter three verse fifteen. It says Whosoever hateth his brother is a murderer. And ye know that no murderer hath eternal life abiding in him. Uh if you go to Galatians 5:19 through 22, uh, it gives you the understanding that murderers do not inherit the kingdom of God. If you have hate in your heart, any racism in your heart, God sees you as a murderer and you will not inherit the kingdom of God if you are a racist. I don't, it doesn't matter what color you are. You could be a white racist. You can be a black racist. You could be a Latino racist. You could be a Filipino racist. You could be a Japanese racist. It does not matter. If you have any hate towards any color skin, hell is waiting on you. If you think Christ, Jesus Christ, died for only white people, Hell waiting on you. If you think Jesus Christ died for only black people, hell is waiting on you. If you think Jesus Christ died for only Latinos, Filipinos, etc., hell is waiting on you. Romans 2.11, God it says God has no respect of person. God, God has no care for skin color of what you are, how, how tall you are, how big you are, how smart you are, how intelligent you are. God does not care. You still have a chance for eternal life as long as you come to repentance. So if you have any hate in your heart for any skin color, if you're a black bigot, a white bigot, Latino bigot, if you're a racist, hell is waiting on you. You must come to repentance if you are a racist. It doesn't matter how much Holy Ghost that you have. I don't care how many times you speak in the tongues. If you die a racist, that is hate in your heart. And God sees you as a murderer. As I just read in 1 John chapter 3, verse 15. Let's go to uh, the book of John. Chapter 3, verse, it started 34. It says... A new commandment I give unto you, that ye love one another, as I loved you. This is Jesus Christ speaking. That ye also love one another. Verse 35. By this, all men know that ye are my disciples, if ye love one to another. So with that being said, I don't care how much Holy Spirit that you have, how many times you are speaking in tongues, if you have hate in your heart for a for over another race or any type of racism, you are not a disciple of Christ. You must come to repentance if you are racist. If you believe that Jesus only died for a certain race, you must come to repentance for that hate in your heart. Because God says, if you have hate in your heart, you have committed murder, and you know that murderers do not, do not have eternal life. Murders do not inherit the kingdom of God. And I told you what scripture you can go to to see that murders do not inherit the kingdom of God. And that's Galatians 5, 19 through 22. Now somebody hopped in my comments and said something about racism. Or even speaking against it. Some people have said racist things, but hell is waiting on you if you don't repent. Now y'all stay prayed up. God bless.